Hello friends, in this video I will make a forensic detective work and I will make an autopsy of this cable. Now you can see a lot of close pictures of this cable and uh, now let me tell you what happened. So you can see this, it's a very cheap cable. You can see the logo here. And uh, first of all, I have to tell you that you must avoid to use a powerful uh, power supply with a cheap cable, because uh, it can end like this. Now let me tell you how this uh, got on fire. So this was put in a very powerful uh, power supply and was located next to the floor. And that room got flooded because of a broke water pipe and this was sunk in water. And I don't know why, but you can see this uh, was completely on fire. Now let's uh, see why this was on fire. The inside of this uh, USB-C connector it's also damaged. Now let's take a closer look inside. So you can see the fire start from inside. It smells like burn. Now let's clean this. As you can see, this board got out very easy and this because was uh, the soldering was melt completely. Now let's cut this. Now you have a close look of this part and uh, I can bet that the problem starts from here. This somehow made the short circuit and then short circuit propagated to this uh, 
and then fire propagated here. But uh, it's very curious how uh, this can make a short circuit in the water only with 5 volts because it's counterintuitive. I am very very curious what really happened here. But I bet the cable from here to USB it's in perfect shape. And problem appear first here. So here I cut the cable and as you can see the wires are in very good shape. And I will reuse this cable. So uh, I am curious if you see this happening and uh, I wait uh, you tell me what you think was the real cause of this uh, fire. Thanks for watching. Bye.